have a lot of thoughts and feelings about this that I just need to get out. It is so frustrating to me when traditional media networks are so ignorant about new media and YouTube. And we saw this before with Jenna Marble's Good Morning America interview and the interviewer who just completely despised the whole idea of what Jenna was doing. I, as a huge, huge fan of Grace, Hannah and Mamrie, was just so disappointed because this interview on HLN, I don't know, I'm not American, HLN's Showbiz Tonight thing, it had the potential to be so great. I know they didn't have much time to speak to them, but just, oh my god, I can't even. I don't know whether it was the interviewer or the researchers behind the show, but if you haven't seen the the interview, the guy just as soon as he spoke to the girls instantly, so you guys seem to like drinking a lot, huh? Mm. It was the entire interview. Um, this is making me so angry. The entire interview made these girls out to be alcoholics. Like all they did was drink. That's that was all he focused on. He barely mentioned Camp Dakota. He didn't ask what it was about. He didn't mention the fact memory Mem co-wrote it. He didn't say anything about Hannah's raising money to go around the world, raising, you know, helping food banks. He didn't mention any of these things. I just... Oh. You could have taken five minutes and googled Grace Herbig's name, clicked on her Wikipedia page and found out she's no longer Daily Grace. It's Grace. It's Grace. Just the smallest amount of research. It was not put into it. And this is what annoys me is that traditional media just does not understand new media at all. You could see on their faces, like when the interview, he was like, okay, thanks for coming in, girls. They were like, oh, is that it? Are you not gonna actually mention our film that we made by ourselves? I don't even remember Grace having the opportunity to speak. Thank God they have a viewer base and fan base that's loyal enough that they will, they will, buy the movie and they will promote it themselves. They don't need traditional media to do that, I think, as we have just proved with this so disappointing interview. But, and I know it's not just me or like the other Holy Trinity fan members that are upset by this. Like, if you look on Hannah and Mamrie's tumblers, they are reblogging all of these comments saying, well, that was disappointing. I think we need to get them on Ellen because I think Ellen will understand, hopefully. Ellen knows what's up, right? She knows, like, the YouTube kind of scene. I'm so sorry to just unleash these feelings, but I had a lot of them, and I feel like I needed to get them off my chest because I care about these girls, and um, it's a shame when they're not respected pro properly by people who have more power in the traditional media networks despite the fact they are incredibly hardworking and they probably should, they deserve all of the respect and all of the time that you give them. Even that four and a half minute interview, they deserved to have their say and actually speak about the film that they made rather than being accused of being alcoholics. There's my thoughts. Goodbye!